Hey guys, and welcome back to Paints Plays Paper Mario. In the last part, we defeated the, uh, Tut and Koopa. That's right. I almost forgot the name, uh, but we defeated Tut and Koopa, rescued the second star spirit, and learned, uh, of our next enemy, the invincible Tubba Bubba. And I'm sure you're wondering, why are we in a Dry Dry Outpost? Shouldn't we be outside Dry Dry Ruins? Well, I wanted to, you know, just for... You know, to keep things smooth and going, I wanted to start in Dry Dry Outpost because, well, if you didn't notice, we are really low on items. We've only got honey syrup. And I want to, you know, pick up a couple things because, you know, just like pick up a couple mushrooms, uh, maybe uh, another um, honey syrup, and I uh, want to also get a Thunderbolt. Because, you know, those are just all really useful items, and I thought, you know, why not? I mean, pick them up. And, uh, yeah, now our inventory is a bit fuller now. We don't have to worry as much. But anyway, so, yeah, now that we've done that, I just wanted to show that I was, you know, collecting all those items. But anyway, so now that we've done that, we should head back to Toe Town. So let's go and make our way there. Um, I don't think there's really anything eventful going on, so... As far as I can remember, I probably... There's probably something going on that I forgot about. But anyway, so if not, I'll cut, I'll cut back to when I'm in Toe Town. But if there's something that happens... Or something that I can do, you know, whoa, 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 whoa. Avoid that guy, because... Uh, actually, you know what, I honestly don't know what he does. I honestly... You know, I'm going to risk it. Let's stand in him. Okay, yeah, he just sends you to a random spot, I believe, in the uh, desert. So what I recommend doing if this happens... Just, well, not get hit by him, for one. And, uh... See if you can find your way back. It's kind of confusing this area. Oh, and we found our way back. <laughs> we were just uh, too. Because uh, if you find this little pathway, you're on the right track to the exit of Dry Dry uh, Desert. So you just keep following this pathway and uh, avoid any enemies, unless you want to find them. I mean, get extra experience, which is really nice. And look, let's talk to uh, this guy. What? Well, what a luck. No clues about the ruins. I'm getting so frustrated, I just might have to give up the excavation for now. How very sad. I say, Mario, that artifact you hold in your hand, it looks like it's quite important. Do my eyes deceive me, or is that a clue to dry dry ruins? Mario, old chum, I beg of you, could you possibly part with it? Let's give him the artifact that we found in dry dry ruins. If you remember, we picked up the little like, bear-looking thing in the, uh, Dry Dry Ruins, and it's actually a little side quest item that we can give to him. I forget his name. Uh, anyways. Soon now, the mysterious Dry Dry Ruins will rise from the sands that conceal them. As a brilliant archaeologist, I say it must be so. I suppose a thank-you gift is in order. Hey, old boy. Here you go, then. Little does he know that we already ro roast the Dry Dry Ruins out of the ground. So he can just freely go. He doesn't need that little artifact, but hey. Anything that makes him happy. So, uh, yeah, we're now back at, uh, the little canyon area. Let's go and save, because reasons. And, uh, let's head on up to here. Actually, you know, I want to get, uh, you know, I know I hate Paracarry in battle, but I didn't really get to, like I said, I didn't really get to make use of him, you know, in the boss battle, so I'll get him out and show, show him off a little bit. Because I haven't really done that except for, you know, when I first got him. Hey there, hold up a second, partner. If you remember this guy when we were coming to Dry Dry Desert, this guy stopped us because he works for Bowser and he was looking for us. So now that he's here... Yep, very similar. You look like that lot like this fellow Mario who's on Bowser's wanted poster. Now give, what's your name? Now, I believe we can lie to him and he might not... I think we have to, like, even if we lie to him, he'll figure it out. So let's just tell him we're Mario. Mario? Well, I'll be! If you're Mario, I reckon I've got to bust you up. Alright, so now there's an optional boss fight, I believe? It might be required, I don't know. But we get two chances to do it. So yeah, now we have this. And we also have our new ability, Lullaby, which will put enemies to sleep. So if I need that, I'll use it. But if I don't... You know, I won't waste a turn doing it. So anyways, it's going to start off with a jump, just regular jump, because I think he has 20 health in total. 
And the reason I didn't do this till now is because he's actually a very tough boss fight if you go in before you, you know, do all of Dry Jar Ruins and all that. So I just recommend, uh, you know, taking him on afterwards so you have more, uh, you know, strength under your belt and you have a better hammer, but actually that doesn't really help because he's an air enemy. And come on, yeah, only one damage, awesome. Ah, oh, but of course, he hurt Paracarry. Man, he's all he's done ever since he got him in battle is take damage. But um, uh, anyway, so let's uh, come on. Yes, sorry. Right. Got the combo on him again, and now Paracarry's back up. All right, yeah, that's uh, that's just like the running away thing where you gotta rapidly press A and then uh. You know, hope that the little cursor lands on the bar that you filled, and the faster you press, the more it fills. But anyways, let's uh, do a power jump, because I'll do twice as much damage as we normally been doing. And let's do a shell shot, because I believe that does five damage, and that's actually a lot. He he does have good moves, but they're very unreliable, like I'll show here. Like, because we got to hold left, and then... Ugh. Yes, we got it, alright. So, I mean, he's got great moves, but the thing is, I just don't... Like, his upgraded abilities are not that good. Like, I, I mean, I will be upgrading him, probably. Uh, maybe. I don't know if I will. Anyways. It's just uh, his upgraded abilities are not, you know, all that worth, you know, the effort of, you know, upgrading him. And, you know, spending time, you know, making sure he's better. But anyways, that didn't make any sense of what I just said. But anyways, let's go and hit him. Maybe we'll finish him off here. Yes! Okay, I did a lot of damage. We didn't finish him off, but hey. Come on. Fill up that bar, fill up that bar. Fill... Yes, awesome. All right. The only way we couldn't have gotten that one was if we didn't press A at all, really, because it was, like, right at the edge. Come on. Alright, I think he's very, very close to dying now. Maybe this'll do it. Ah, uh, no. Oh, we've only taken four damage so far. So, I mean, it's not like we're in any danger whatsoever. Uh, yeah, just keep smacking him. There's nothing really- this boss fight's kind of boring now. There we go, finally! Jeez, that took way too long. I mean, we got 15 star points out of that, which is, yeah, not as good as it should have been. Oh well. Yo, I got whooped! And there he goes. Him gone. That was not worth all that time. Jeez, that took way too long. I'm just going to fly across here. And, uh, you know, I'll cut back to when I'm at the train station, actually, because there's nothing... Actually... Actually, yeah, I'll cut... I won't come back to the train station because I just remembered something, but yeah, I'll see you guys in a sec. Hey guys, we're back. So the reason I'm not at the train station is because we had this little block here, and before we couldn't hit it because we only had our wood hammer, but now we have our little stone hammer, and we can obliterate it! <laughs> With cool little 3D effects in the paper game. Anyways, there's a mega block here! Whoa! Not the kind that you play with as a kid, the one that upgrades your party members. Which party member would you like to upgrade? Alright, um, hmm. Yeah, let's... I'm gonna try and give Paracarry a chance. Do you want to upgrade this member? Yeah, why not? Paracarry is upgraded to super rank. And uh, let's look at his ability now that we've you know, upgraded him and made him more powerful. Uh, let's see. Party, uh. Alright. Check abilities. He now has airlift. Carry enemy away from battle. Yeah, I mean, that's great if you're dealing with a tough enemy, but it's a very unreliable move. Uses up three flower points, and yeah, I just, I don't even think you get any experience if you carry an enemy away from battle. So I mean, I guess if you're having trouble, you know, taking out a tough enemy, I mean, it's worth a shot, but it's an unreliable move for one, because it works just like the runaway, it's really much up to chance even if you press the A button really, really fast. So it's not all that worth it, but anyways, we're back at the train station now, so uh, let's talk to the conductor of the train! Hello, sir. This train is bound for Toad Town Station. I am a toad with an epic voice. Are you coming aboard? Yes, we are. All right, so let's go and aboard this train and get back to Toad Town. All aboard for Toad Town. There's only two of us. You don't have to shout. Jeez, rude. And I believe we can cut out the little sequence animation to get into Toad Town. Yeah, we can. 
I don't like the music, but I mean, I don't want this video to last, you know, too long, so let's go and cut that out. And we're now back in Toe Town with a little cheery music. Toe Town, Toe Town! Yes, I can hear you. Shut up. Alright, anyway. And that was a <laughs> that was a terrible voice crack. Holy crap! I know some of you are gonna be making fun of me in the comments, but anyways. Ooh. Yeah, that's that's important later. I'll avoid touching that guy for now. I used the worst word for that. Holy crap! <laughs> I meant I just I said I'll avoid touching that guy for now. Taking that out of context, that could be really bad. <laughs> but I'm uh you know now that we're back in Toe Town, what is our next de destination? I'm sure you're wondering. You know where do we go next? We um do I want to do that? So actually, you know what? Before I do that, there's something I want to do. Something I want to show you guys because I haven't shown this off yet. It's been available to us for a while. If you go over here and take this little pipe, you can go underground Toe Town. And this is a not this isn't a secret area by any means. It's actually a really useful area. See these little uh, pipe things here? Blooper! First, I gotta fight Blooper before I can show you what those little square things are. Alright, anyways, so what you wanna do is you wanna just attack this guy. He doesn't have that much health. His attacks don't do all that much. And I don't think we airlift works on bosses, so let's just not even attempt doing that. Awesome. Six oh yeah, and since we upgraded him, mean, now it goes 60. Which, I mean, that's great. That's that's powerful, but that's his only useful super move. And I think even his ultra move isn't all that great. And then again, I can't exactly remember what it is. And so it is probably something super amazing. And I'm just probably being a piece of crap right now. But anyways, we'll just keep attacking him using our best moves. I believe he has 20 health in total, but then again, last time I said somebody has 20 health. I was obviously wrong, because that battle took way too long. I'm not even sure if I'll cut that battle, but... Yeah, this one's not going to take as long, because Blooper is actually meant to be fought earlier, I believe? But yeah, so... Wait, no, we couldn't have fought him earlier, because that stone was in the way. So we couldn't have been able to fight until we get that stone hammer. Silly me. But anyways, just keep jumping on him, attacking him, you know, doing whatever you can to damage him. And then... that should... Ah, not do it, dang it. Come on, die already, you stupid squid blooper thingy! That looks like a ninja because of the mask. Actually, let's... you know, we haven't done this yet. Let's try a lullaby on it, see if that works, because... I haven't shown that offhand, I haven't really gotten the chance to. Because we got that last part and I, you know... Why not? Let's see if we can... Put this nope, not it didn't work. Crap. Let's try attacking it. Yes, we did it. Alright. So that wouldn't really matter if we put it to sleep or not. We take it out in, in that exact turn. So we get 20 star points or only 15 away from the level up awesome. Anyway, so see these little squares here? What you want to do? Hit this with your hammer. And we now have fast no oh, come on. We have fast travel locations to p regions of, you know, Mushroom Kingdom that we've, you know, been to, so we, if we want to go back, say, to, uh, Dry Dry Outpost for some reason, we now can instantly just through these pipes. Here's Koopa Village. So we can come back here anytime we want to, for, if we ever need to. And lastly, I believe, what's this one? I want to see this is, uh, Koopa Bros Fortress. No, oh, I don't know, it's, uh, Goomba Village. That's right. Yeah, there's, uh... We're now back in Goomba Village, the place where we started, which is really neat. Let's talk to Goompa. Howdy, Mario. How you doing? You Goompapa, right? The name's Paracarry. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. And I changed his voice last time I spoke as him. Anyway, I'm not consistent with my voices, if you haven't been able to tell. Another letter. Der duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. Hey, thanks. Much obliged, Mr. Po Postal Worker. Oh, great news! Fishing is one of my hobbies, and this is from a friend who's planning a fishing trip. I can't wait. Oh, sorry to a pile work on you, but could you give... Could I give you a letter? If it's at all possible for you to deliver this to a toad named Musty, he hangs around the castle garden. I'd really appreciate it. 
All right, so we got a letter to li Ugh, can't talk. A letter to deliver to Musty Run the Castle Gardens. Will I do those side quests? Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. But anyway, so yeah, we uh, got the fast travel points. We got ourselves back to Toad Town. Did a few things. Uh, we fought the, a couple of optional bosses. And yeah, so in the next part, we will uh, do things. I'll probably go and fight the next. Well, we can get our make ourselves to the next boss. But anyway, so next time I shall do that in the next part. I am running this for way too long. I shall see you guys then. Bye bye.